Positive trends starting on Monday, more businesses will be able to reopen. The big one being indoor dining. Seating inside will be limited, but it is good news for owners who are struggling since the pandemic. Other businesses given the green light include offices at 50% capacity, nail salons, massage parlors, and personal trainers. As WBZ's Mike LaCrosse shows us, business owners say they will be ready. Today, thanks to the progress that we're making in fighting the virus, step two will begin on Monday, June 22nd. Step two of phase two in the reopening process means the return of services at nail salons and spas, along with indoor dining at restaurants. We're going to take the weekend to prepare the inside, get the extra tables out. The team at Coppersmith in South Boston is excited indoor dining is resuming Monday. As soon as we go to the table, we are dropping waters off. Following the governor's announcement Friday, the staff began training to serve customers inside again while following social distancing protocols. So make sure you talk to them. The Massachusetts Restaurant Association says indoor dining is a critical step forward. For 97 days, every restaurant operator in Massachusetts has looked at this moment, wanted this moment, and prepared for this moment. It's just another layer of protection for all of us. Employees at the G2O spa and salon in Boston were also going through orientation ahead of Monday. It's very easy install. In step two, they're allowed to offer close personal services like manicures, pedicures, massages, and skin care. We take temperature of all of our employees and all of our clients as they walk in. A number of social distancing requirements will be in place along with protective barriers. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be great to see the faces again and, and you know, see people that we haven't seen in months. Also starting Monday, offices can increase their capacity from 25% up to 50%. Reporting from Boston, I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.